Post game with Marcus Roeders following a 3-0 victory over Seton Hall. Three goals in the first half, and really it was just coasting from there. Uh, yeah, I mean, I, I would say it was coasting, but uh, it was still hard work. You know, uh, you know, uh, we had hope for this for a while because we created the chances, and we did it again today. And uh, a lot of players were involved. Uh, everybody that could play ended up playing. Uh, we created some nice opportunities right from the start. And uh, we have to be pleased, you know, we finally earned the result that, that we're looking for uh, based on our play and what we're trying to do and, and the opportunities that we're having. So, you know, happy with our team. Uh, a lot of players, even the ones maybe that weren't directly involved with the goal or assist, you know, deserve, deserve a lot of credit. And, um, you know, it's definitely a positive to build on after, after Friday, you know, coming back on a Sunday, which is usually not, not easy. I thought we had a really nice performance, and congratulations to our team. They'll be facing a UConn team on Friday that's a little bit higher up on the table. Also, senior night, uh, a special night for the girls, right? Uh, yeah, it's it's you know it's a special night. Uh, we try not to make it you know overly emotional. Uh, you have to focus on the game, and I know the girls are going to be looking forward to that. And uh, you know, it's going to be a, a big, highly ranked, very good team coming into Valley Fields. We we have a couple more home games scheduled now, so definitely want to end on a high roll before we have to go on the road. And UConn is the next team, so uh, I think we definitely have some to build on out of the game that we had today, and uh, we'll take that forward and you know put put some additional pieces into place and you know, fine tune it. You know, this time of the year, I don't think you. You don't really drastically go into changing things up. You're just trying to make what you do well, You're trying to make that better. And um, scoring three goals today is obviously a positive. We're back on the shutout trail, and hopefully we can keep that going. Three is the lucky number for you. Three goals, three points, and the third game of a five-game homestand. The fourth one will be against UConn on Friday night. Marcus, glad to have you. Thanks. Appreciate it. Thanks for coming out.